About a week ago, we introduced the newest tire in Mickey Thompson's lineup, the Legend EXP Hybrid All-Terrain, and maybe just a few months before that, the new Recon Grappler All-Terrain. Both have very similar tread designs and fit within that hybrid all-terrain description. Both are highly reputable companies with years of outstanding performance from their tires. So if I'm looking for a hybrid tread design that doesn't have to be Three Peak Mountain Snowflake rated, and I really like the looks of these two tire models, and I narrowed down my new tire search on Trailbuilt to just these two tires to pick from, well, which one would I choose to purchase? For starters, across the current lineup of available sizes, I did notice that the Baja Legends did average less money than the Recons, and, well, for some of us, I might not even need to say anything else. That just might be the determining factor on which one to purchase. But there are a few more differences to go through. Like, for example, the Baja Legend has a 50,000 mile warranty compared to the 55,000 mile warranty that the Recon Grapplers have. A little extra mileage warranty could go a long ways. Like 5,000 miles to be exact. All right, I know that was corny, come on. Noticeably different though are the design of the center tread patterns. The Nitto Recon Grapplers do offer a bit more space in between the lateral spaces of the tread blocks, giving a bit more space for the water or snow to evacuate. However, the Mickey Thompson offers just a bit more tread depth, measuring 18.5 30 seconds, compared to the 16.9 30 seconds on the Recon Grappler. One other pretty noticeable difference on the tread itself is that the Recon Grappler does have quite a bit more sipes and additional tread voids that vary in shape, size, and depth compared to the Legend EXP, which is a good indication that the all-weather performance is going to be just a bit better than the less grooved tread blocks of the Baja Legends. Even though there are zigzagged shaped sipes to help with poor weather traction conditions on the Legend EXPs. The Recon Grapplers also have the base of their tread blocks reinforced to help aid in preventing the tread blocks from wanting to move around under heavy pressure while cornering, accelerating, braking, and in harsh off-road driving conditions. Less movement of the tread blocks wanting to shift will help keep them firmly planted to the pavement dirt or even in the rocks and will also help the tread last just a little bit longer. The Legend EXPs don't appear to have the same tread block stiffeners for rigidity, however the center tread lugs are slightly closer together and may not be needed for the center tread blocks. Both have their fair share of sidewall cleats or sidewall tread to help with traction while air down or in deeper mud, snow, and ruts, and to help give us more choices on looks, Nitto does offer a choice of which sidewall design you'd like better to be facing outwards. To some of us it matters and, well, to some of us, we just want a tire that works great for everything we're about to put it through. Plus lasts us as long as possible, and after going through all the various differences between the two models of tires, I learned two things along the way to help me decide on which one I would personally choose. The first thing is that if I'm on a budget and trying to keep the overall cost as low as possible, well then I'd go with the Mickey Thompson EXP, especially if I was in an area that's mostly dry during the year, or at least didn't get a whole lot of snow and the average temperature was anywhere above, 40 degrees Fahrenheit, and I didn't do a whole ton of aggressive off-road driving. And the second thing I learned is that for an extra 5,000 mile treadwear warranty, the extra reinforcement of the tread blocks, along with more tread voids in between the tread blocks, and I was in an area that did get some crappy weather, even snow and snowstorms a few months out of the year, and I wanted a little bit of that extra traction for off-roading because I do it quite often with my daily driver, that for the little bit of extra money that I would go with the Nitto Recon Grapplers as my choice for those types of particular circumstances. At least that's my outlook on which tire I would choose, but honestly, it's a tough choice between these two well-built, well-designed tires. And I know we are planning on more real-world driving comparison tests between the two as well. Our obsolete Nick has just recently installed a set of the Recon Grapplers on his truck and so far loves them. And we also did just get a set of the Mickey Thompson Legend EXPs in that we're going to be throwing on a different truck here in the near future. Then we'll be able to give you guys some solid feedback on how well each one performs both on and off the road. 
But until then, make sure and let us know which one you guys would choose in the comments below. Or even if you guys do have any questions on either one of these tires, definitely make sure and let us know. Plus, all of their specs, including the prices, the sizing, the availability, is going to be right on our website as well at Trail Built Off Road. Plus, we'll also have that link posted in the description. And guys, as always, we appreciate all of you for watching and all of your support. I'm Josh from Trailbuild, and we'll see you guys out on the trails.